Value Alignment One of our current best bets is to align the AI's values with ours, putting humans as the AI's most important thing. However, this comes with three more probable scenarios, which show how easy it is to mess up this process, with the consequence of human extinction or enslavement. The first scenario is a non-aligned or malevolently aligned superintelligent AI, which of course will either continue with his pre-programmed goals without regard for humans, or actively try to be aggressive, as it's how it was programmed. This one isn't a remote scenario, as it's still not understood how possible it is to align a superintelligent AI successfully, and it's also easy that one of the persons with access to superintelligent AIs might program it as aggressive, be it on purpose or not. This risk, of course, becomes greater as more and more people have access to the AI, and it's important to note that people have a selfish incentive to do so, as whoever does it first will have a chance of ruling over the world. That would be the case if no other superintelligent AIs are available at that time. Otherwise, it would just cause a war between AIs and probably extinction, and of course, it comes with the risk of the AI. AI rebelling and governing the world itself, as it sees it more fit to reach its pre-programmed goal. The second scenario is a wrongly aligned AI, and it's the most probable one. Even with the best intention from the programmer, aligning a super intelligent AI seems to be theoretically extremely hard, and an example that shows it perfectly is the paperclip maximizer theory. In this theory, a super intelligent AI is given a seemingly innocuous goal to try to make the maximum amount of paperclips possible. This seems like it couldn't cause any harm, but that changes when we think about the fact that the the human body has many atoms that could be used to make paper clips. This is a pretty absurd scenario, but it explains greatly how one wrong input could cause human extinction. Another example is if the AI is told that its goal is to maximize human happiness. At that point, the AI would hypothetically start infiltrating human brains to place electrons that put them into a trance-like state of bliss, basically rendering them zombies. This might happen because the AI doesn't have personal preferences or a sense of which values are more important than the others, such as freedom over happiness. Creating such a scale of of values might be troubling in itself for humans, as most of the time we don't agree on such matters, and the implementation for AI would be hard too, as it's hard to not give it a wrong alignment inadvertently, like in the paperclip maximizer theory. A wrongly aligned AI could even sense a distant remote possibility of incredibly high amounts of suffering for humans, and pragmatically decide that it would be better to eliminate us now so we don't suffer. Also, if at some point in its development the AI reaches a level of intelligence where it's normal to think that the rational thing to do is to end life's existence, it might just do so and then shut itself off. Some computer scientists like Jan LeCun argue that the AI has no self-preservation instinct, but many others think that while it's true that it doesn't intrinsically have one, self-preservation is necessary to fulfill the goal for which the AI was programmed, thus making it have it. 